Good evening. Glad you're with us tonight. A former Bob Jones University student filed a lawsuit against that school, Furman University, a Furman football player, and a Furman police officer. The suit claims negligence during an assault investigation. 7 News reporter Ann Maxwell has our story. The Furman Police Department called SLED to investigate. Solicitor Walt Wilkins declined to press charges, saying there wasn't enough evidence for criminal charges. Now that former student, identified in the suit as Jane Rowe, is bringing a civil case and seeking damages. A get-together at Furman University last October led to a call to campus police, a trip to the hospital, a SLED investigation, punishment for drinking by Bob Jones University, and now a lawsuit. In the suit filed in Greenville County Thursday, a woman claims she was raped by a Furman football player, identified as John Doe. The suit says Doe, quote, negligently and recklessly engaged in sexual intercourse with the plaintiff when a reasonable person would have known the plaintiff was unable to consent. The suit names Doe, as well as Bob Jones University, Furman University, its police department, and Furman police officer Trevor Whitfield. The SLED report shows Officer Whitfield responded to the call about a possible assault on Furman's campus. The woman in question, and a friend, told officers they were afraid they would be expelled from the Christian University for drinking. The BJU handbook says, quote, students of any age who drink any alcoholic beverages, whether on or off campus, forfeit their privilege of enrollment as students. The suit says Officer Whitfield, as an alumnus of Bob Jones University, expressed disappointment in their behavior and notified the university because of his personal disapproval. The plaintiff accuses him of being motivated by reckless disregard for her rights, well-being, and safety. The suit also alleges Whitfield told the BJU students they could either go to the hospital or go to jail. They elected to go to the hospital and were taken to Greenville Memorial, where hours later, the suit alleges a Bob Jones official told the plaintiff she was being being expelled for consuming alcohol. The suit says the university made that decision without investigating the allegations of drinking or holding any type of hearing. The plaintiff accuses all of the defendants of violating policies and procedures. A spokesperson from Bob Jones University says that student was actually suspended for the remainder of the year and has the option to reapply for the fall 2020 semester. He also said the university does not comment on pending litigation. In Greenville and Maxwell 7 News. According to a spokesperson from Furman that John Doe is no longer a student there, Officer Whitfield works for a different law enforcement agency. We were unable to reach the officer tonight for comment. 